I was waiting for my bus the other day, and this guy comes up to me and asks, do you want to play a little card game? I said, sure, let's play. He asked me to choose two places, one where I really want to go, and the other where I've already been. But you have three cards, I said. He smiles and tells me to write down where I've been twice, on two different cards, and the other on the third. He then takes the three cards and looks at them. The first card reads, Goa. Then he opens the second card, which reads, Goa again. And the third card, which reads, Manali. He then opens the Manali card, looks at me and asks, Is this the place you really want to go? I said yes. He says all you have to do is keep an eye on that card while putting it at the bottom. I said that's easy, the Manali card is at the bottom. He says no, that's the Goa card. I said fine, if Goa's at the bottom, the Manali must be on the top. He says no, that's also the Goa card. I said alright, if Goa's at the top and the bottom, then Manali must be in the middle. He says no, that's also the Goa card. I said that's not fair, as you're using three Goa cards. He says I'm kidding while showing me the Manali card at the bottom. And adds, as a matter of fact, you must have got so excited that you wrote Manali on all the three cards. By now I'm completely confused. I said, well, that's not fair, you're using three Manali cards. He said, okay, we've got the Goa card, another Goa, and another. I said, well, you're obviously cheating. He said, well, yeah. In life, it doesn't matter whether you go to Goa or to Manali. But what really matters is what you explore.